Okay, so here's my project. The little, the little book house. Little free library is one of the places you can sign up and register them. I got the plans out of Wood Magazine for the book nook, the neighborhood book nook. And it's a good little design. It's pretty simple. They do a lot of batten stuff. I'm going to do a little bit of that. My dimensions are a little different too, and my roofing is a little different. But this is the March of 2016 issue, if you want to look it up and get the plans. What all started, somebody gave me some old, not old, but over, over use, over wood on a fence project, some extra wood. So these started off as treated fence boards, this project. I glued them up, and I'm going to caulk it and put a batten on there. Have a shelf installed. Paperbacks fit up here with enough room to put your finger in there and grab it. You can probably fit, I don't know, 10, 12. And the bottom is for taller and bigger books. I have some wood. I'm going to cut a frame for a door and I'm going to put some plexiglass so passers by can see books in there. The roof, we're going to have some panels for the roof that are made out of the same material. I need to glue another piece onto this, but what it's going to end up being is it going, it's going to end up like this, if you look at it. Okay, you see there's going to be an overhang because it's going to be three panels wide, so it's going to actually be more like this. It's going to have a pretty good overhang to protect the books and the door and all that. I want everything protected as much as possible. These are basically just facades, these two panels on either side. That's my attic right in there. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to cut these at an angle and they're going to match the angle on these. So when these get screwed in to the ceiling or the roof as it were, then I'll have something to attach the facade panels to the little triangular panels. So you got these are uh, actually not fence boards, these are cedar siding boards. And I'm going to have a, a piece across the top that I'm going to mount the roof to on each side. All this is going to be protected. This isn't treated wood, so it's going to be underneath uh, the roof, all of this. So once this thing gets assembled, there's a, a second post. There's a post already out in front of our house uh, next near the mailboxes, and that's where it's going to be mounted. I'll give you some dimensions on this guy. Since I'm left-handed, I have to do it the wrong way. It's 11 inches deep. It is. Almost well, 23 and a quarter tall with the the roof height and the flooring height down here. So that's the total height. And then the width we have across the front uh, about 16 and a half, give or take. So. Those are the dimensions I built it to. This is this is just about a 45 degree angle right here. It's, I think it's exact. If not, it's very close. So this is going to be a little book house, and I will do more videos as it progresses.